should have known It's a mistake getting close to you There are good bullets coming at your motherfucking heart, girl I'm gonna leave some holes through you I've had enough of you about the bad as you played your game So I lost my patience, I gave you my all but Yo, what's going on, you beautiful people of the internet? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name is Amir You can call me Magical Welcome back to another video In today's video, we're gonna be reacting and listening to Tom McDonald's new track called Withdrawals came out a few days ago sorry for the late reaction but I'm busy I have two more exams left and I'll be a free man okay so before we get into the video please hold on <clears throat> make sure to click the subscribe button we're getting close to 5,000 subscribers that's this close to a million okay and if you enjoy the video please drop a like it's the best way to support me and this channel and again Sorry for the camera quality. My camera right here is acting up. Something up with the battery or something. So I'm using my webcam for, for these videos. And it's a lot easier in my opinion because, you know, anyways, you don't need to know the technical aspects, okay? And uh, follow me on Instagram. We're getting close to 2,000 followers over there. It's the best way to interact with me. Send me stuff. DM me. Let's talk. Let's get to know each other, okay? And check out my song on Spotify called Riding Solo, all right? Anyways, without further ado, let's jump right in and listen to Mr. Tom McDonald. Here we go. The doctor said to talk to him if I wanted to get off my meds. But I never called his office in, poured the bottle in the garbage can. I'm stuck in this apartment and I'm anxious like the cops are here. I tried to call like all my friends, none of them are answering. Is this the moment where I can't control it? Got no appetite, I guess the party's over, I can't sleep. I like the theme of the song, man, I won't lie. I really, really enjoy the theme of the song, but what the hell is up with the freaking tears? Is this the moment where I can't control? Look at the tears, man. Come on, Tom. I think you can do better. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm just nitpicking. The, 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 the tears kind of look weird. They look oily. But uh, I like the acting, all right? It's good. I like the beat as well. The beat is quite mellow. I got no appetite. I guess the party's over. I can't sleep at night and I keep rolling over because my skin is itchy and the paranoia got me worried sick and it is so annoying. I've been throwing up and look like motor oil, but I chose to quit. I've been throwing up and look like motor oil. Ooh, that was a good bar. That was a good bar. Nice. And now I can't avoid it. The right things to do are the hardest choice. No quarter. I can't read the other tattoo. No quarter. Okay. This is this the moment when I need a donor? Liver failing from the liquor pouring? All the room oh. is spinning. It ain't vodka soda. What is almost killing me is being sober. Talk about pitfalls. Surrounded by brick walls. This is what kids call withdrawal. Deleted every number. That was good. That was good. I like that. Okay. Let's see the chorus. This is what kids call withdrawal. Deleted every number from my phone. I'm staying home. Really wish that I was drunk with all my friends I'm gonna beat it or I won't and overdose Really wish that I was high with all my friends Never care for therapists My arrogance embarrassing It isn't fair to tear with this Addiction place my parents in I'm scared repair will never fix The voluntary negligence The wear and tear my errors did I really appreciate artists that dive into this topic I genuinely mean this because uh, you know a lot of people go through addiction and battle certain demons uh, differently okay we have actors we have uh, celebrities we have freaking normal people that go through it and nobody knows about it but when you're someone like Tom and you have a platform and a fan base who already knows about your struggles but you dedicate a whole song talking about this it just shines light on the issue and uh you know conveys this message to maybe his young fans that don't make the same mistakes don't make the same decisions that he made because you know it has negative impact it has negative side effects on your life and and just everything so i respect that a lot they almost had to bury me is this the moment where I screw up and relapse? Waste all my money on rehab. Can't take a pill from the doctor to relax. Lash out in anger whenever I react. Feel like a weak man. I don't want to be that. Living every day to get a buzz on the weekend. I'm in the deep end fighting with demons. Trying to stay clean. I just really need a reason. My bones Whoa. are shaking in my hands and feet. I see my rib cage, but I can't eat. I still wake up panicking. So I see my rib cage, but I can't eat. Oh, so I can't sleep. I just sit in the back. 
hands and feet. I see my rib cage, but I can't eat. I still wake up panicking so I can't sleep. I just sit in the bathtub and try to breathe. Talk about pitfalls, surrounded by brick walls. This is what kids call withdrawal. Deleted every number from my phone. I'm staying home. Really wish that I was drunk with all my friends. I'm gonna beat it or I won't. An overdose. Really wish that I was high with all my friends. I've never felt this bad before. I don't know if I'll make it. Don't have the strength to get off the floor right now But I'm hoping and praying My whole life I wanted more This might be the end But now I've had too much fun It's over now I loved what I hated Deleted Dude, that bridge, that bridge was really nice His singing, pretty decent man pretty decent damn bro okay okay respect mad respect every number from my phone i'm staying home really wish that i was drunk with all my friends I'm gonna beat it or i won't who's emily who's emily on his uh the tattoo above his eyebrow let me know if you know who emily is this mom I don't know. Really wish that I was high with all my friends. every number from my phone. I'm staying home. Really wish that I was drunk with all my friends. I'm gonna beat it or I won't. An overdose. Really wish that I was high with all my friends. Video by Nova Rockefeller. Damn. Damn. Let me drop this a like real quick. Boom. 2.5 million views already. Sheesh. Folks, ladies and gentlemen, listen to me very carefully. This was deep. This was dope. Like the dopamine. <laughs> I really enjoyed this, man. It, The chorus was pretty good. Um, the, the, the concept and the topic of the song. Very well put together. Very well said. And again... Same with Eminem. When Eminem talks about his drug addiction, or used to, it's it, the, the 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 lyricism and the storytelling is so visceral, is so is so meaningful that you kind of feel like you're experiencing this yourself. You know what I mean? And uh, Tom managed to to do that, and I honestly really enjoyed this song i really do believe that artists that go through personal struggles like this have to share their experiences and how they came out of that uh, out of that uh, struggle uh because i know a lot of people go through similar stuff but don't have anyone to talk to about uh don't even talk about it themselves and you know they end up either committing suicide or fall into depression which most of the time leads to suicide or suicidal tendencies um, or again drug addiction alcohol abuse liver failure so many other health problems and it's always very very uh, I personally appreciate it again when artists talk about it and uh, share the story with uh, with their fan base hoping that they can relate to it uh, or they can stop making bad decisions if they're already falling into that uh, road and uh, yeah man mad respect to Tom uh, every song that I've heard so far from him absolute banger uh, absolute like everything from video production to beat making top class top class I want to know if he always makes his own beats or if he has a producer that helps him out uh, with regards to the video Again, his acting was pretty good. Uh, the color correction, the color coding of the video, uh, very well done. Nova always does beautiful camera work, man. This woman is super talented. And uh, yeah, mad respect to both of them. Uh, thank you so much for uh, watching today's video. Hope you enjoyed the, the little reaction and breakdown. If you did, let me know down in the comments. And uh, that's pretty much it. I will see you guys in the next one. My name is Amir. You can call me Manticore. And I'm out of here. Peace. What the fuck did you
could do it to my heart, bitch. You pull it out of my chest and tore it apart. Love is stuff when you're super obnoxious and heartless. Man, I should've known from the start I was thunderstruck when you screwed up my conscious shit. You left me emotionally scarred, thought I fucking lost you. Missed all of my kindness for weakness. Should've never lowered my guard, but girl, I'm a ghost you just like Swayze. The way you lie never fails to amaze me. We rarely share our emotions lately. Your body is limp, but your soul is shady.